Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. This is Bord Olsen from the Toffee Service. Um, today I had a small problem I thought I would make a video about. Um, I wanted to update this one. It gives me frame rates and everything on screen. It's called... Uh, you want to see it when you have it there. Just give it a sec. Revo Tuner Statistic Server. Um, but I could not update it because when you try to uh, uninstall it or update it, it says the service is running and it keeps restarting if you close it. So if I like do it like this, close, wait a few seconds, and it will start. And if you even if you try to fake and uninstall. Like this. First you try and uninstall it, yes. And install, you get this message. The server is running. So you close it. That might actually work, but maybe not fast enough. I don't think so. Close. And you go and you click on it. And it says server inst an installation failed. And the reason for this is because it starts again. And um, you cannot find it in the startup apps because it's not listed here as being an auto starting app, and you can't find it in some config. It's not listed here as automatically starting with Windows either. See? Scroll by. This is not here. So the solution to this is actually quite simple, but it's not obvious. Um, this software has a different software that has a relation to it. MSI Afterburner. If you have MSI Afterburner installed, this one will trigger Reva tuner, tuner and it will also start it again if you have it installed. Um, so what you actually need to do to be able to uninstall it is disable MSI Afterburner by closing it. So when I go here and I close MSI Afterburner it closes both apps. See, it's gone. Now we can go and you can uninstall the app because there is nothing auto starting the Reva Turner one. You don't have to uninstall the Afterburner one. They are not related like that. It's just they, they, the the Afterburner one starts the Reva Turner. You go to uninstall, yes. Uninstall. Do you want to keep your settings? Yes, you can keep your settings if you want. In my case, I want to upgrade the. Yeah. Nope, I don't want to undo it. So close. But now the app should be gone from here. Uh, the um, service is running. It's not a problem really because you can just uh, install the other one on top of it. It should. Uh, it should work. So I'm gonna go and do that now. Uh, there, and I have the install folder there. So, oh. Installation, accept the terms, next, next. Install. It should complete successfully now because there is nothing blocking it. It might be blocked by services, but I don't think so. See, it's um, so after a reboot, the Riva Tuner Statistics Server comes up with the new version. So that's it. Thanks for watching.